How are you today? It's so good to see you in this space. We've been kind of lonely here. It's just, it's built for people. Yeah, thank you for warming our sanctuary, especially. We're happy to have you. Yes, indeed. Welcome to Music at Noon. We're broadcasting live stream from Sacramento, California on this February 9th day in 2022. We have a piano trio today. And when I looked at the music they were planning to play, I said, yes. And one of the things that came to my mind was a box of C's candies. The sampler box with nuts and chews and creams and all that. So do you want to have some C's candy today? Well, let's do it musically, shall we? And the reason I said that is because they have taken excerpted movements from various uh, piano trios. And of course, they're going to be the best ones, right? And so I'm already ready for the feast. And who is doing this for us? Well, we are welcoming back two of the members after more than two years and one of the members after a few months. And uh, we have Igor Veligan on violin. We have Susan Lamb Cook on cello and Gail Blankenberg from Pomona, California on the piano. And the last time we heard them was probably more than two years ago, uh, maybe like two and a half years ago. And so the music they're playing is really full of tasty morsels and I know you're going to enjoy it. After the first piece, they'll talk to you a little bit about the music. So please welcome our piano trio.
Thank you.
Well, thank you so much for being here with us today. We're delighted to be performing for you uh, back again, as Brad said, after more than two years together. And so it's just a real delight to be here with my colleagues, Igor Veligan and Gail Blankenberg. And we did select a program which we hope you will enjoy. Lots of, as Brad described, lots of little morsels. Uh, the first piece on the program, Cafe Music, was written by Paul Schoenfield. And evidently it was inspired um, by a time that he sat in with a piano trio that was playing at a restaurant in Minneapolis. And they were just simply playing evening music and he decided it would be delightful to write a piece which would um, incorporate many different styles of music. Of course you heard a lot of jazz in that one. Um, and so this, uh, that was the first movement of his cafe music which was written back in the 1980s. We're going to proceed with the program, again, with um, individual selections of various uh, piano trios. The next, we're going to play a pair of movements from the Shostakovich Piano Trio in E minor, Opus 67. We're going to play the second, or the third and fourth movements of that, um, that uh, piano trio for you. Um, the first is uh, it's a very slow, um, what, what we would call, you know, a, a largo movement, um, very pensive, and it's followed by a rather lively movement which has actually lots of dark under themes. So that is from the Shostakovich Piano Trio. Uh, we'll play a movement from Clara Schumann, from her uh, lovely um, piano trio, um, and uh, a couple of scherzos from Mendelssohn and Schubert. Uh, then, of course, a lovely um, piece by um, Astro Piazzolla, his Oblivion, and we'll finish up with a movement by uh, Amy Marcy Cheney Beach. Uh, her piano trio was written in 1938, um, just before the First World War. Uh, we're going to play the last movement of that trio for you. And interestingly, Shostakovich's trio was written during the last year of the First World War. So we found that interesting to have both of those on the same program. So we hope you enjoyed this program. And again, thanks for being here today.
Igor, Susan, Gail, you amaze us and maybe amaze me more than you because I know that they are not all in the same area. One is in Southern California. How do they put this together so refined and so nuanced? You know, when you had a box of C's candy, you want more. Guess what we want? Can we have a box of C's candy every year? A big one. It has to last. That was magnificent. And hearing the Amy Beach at the end, obviously that's one of her finer works. You, that's why you included it. That's a seller for Amy Beach, isn't it? That's a seller. But all the music was so varied and so different. And the position, the way you programmed it, was so perfect for contrast and um, um, difference in, in style, con, con, in style. So delicious, stirring, charming, tasty, satisfying. Thank you very, very much for putting this together. And I haven't said this very many times because we haven't been live streaming that long and we haven't had an audience here for me to talk to. But donation, as you know, is important because we have um, fantastic professionals here and we want to honor them appropriately as we can and I speak also to those who are uh, visiting us via live stream if you go to Westminster Presbyterian Church in Sacramento California you'll find the website and then to the upper right corner of that opening page it will say donate and in that, if you click on that, you will see a section just for music at noon. So thank you very much for considering that. And we hope that your day was improved. Mine certainly was. And I think your day will be improved next week also because coincidentally we have a cello and a uh, piano next week, a cello and a piano. And we will hear music of Beethoven, Chopin, and Shostakovich. Hope you can join us. Thanks for being here and have a good week. Bye for now.